Hi, my name is Rick Greenwood. I'm the writer and director of Origin. The project that we're working on right now is called Origin Prologue, which is basically an abbreviated introduction to a feature script I wrote with the same title of Origin, which is about a fallen angel, Gragriel, who doesn't know who or what he is, only that he's drawn to kill people, okay. until one day when he actually saves the life of a, of a young woman, when he decides that she could potentially hold the key in his potential salvation. Um, so he seeks her out and convinces her to help him while they are on their journey trying to discover who he is. They're also being chased by a, a very intelligent police officer. They're also being chased by the stark religious cult that is, has a very, very malicious intent to them. Mm -hmm. So they're being just chased down from every single side. The film is filled with action, violence. It's very much so... an a story which unravels as as it comes together. But deep down the core of the story is really this heartfelt search of one individual to find meaning and purpose in his life. So stylistically, the film's gonna be a dark, noirish thriller. Think of The Crow, Dark City, Sin City, Constantine, Da Vinci Code, Seven. Think of the, the, con the qualities of all those movies and cram it into one, and that would be Origin. Like Seven, just the dark, gritty, realistic quality of that movie. It goes so deep into the, the mind of a serial killer, but no matter what happens, there's always purpose. The Crow, again, it's more of an internal movie, which is how I look at for the character of Raguel. It's someone who, kind of on the verge of insanity, but at the same time, still has heart and passion, but it's that search for that higher purpose and it's salvation. If you look at the, a movie like Constantine, for origin it wouldn't be so much about bringing demons onto this earth, it's more of visual realization of him, he gets these flashing images of hell. It's those flashes that kind of give him a little bit of an insight on who he is. The Da Vinci Code. The overall cinematography, how they use very immersive camera movements to draw the audience in and show them this majestic world that the artist is trying to create. The other strength of that film is, is how they utilize historical artifacts in order to reinforce a story and an idea and a conspiracy which they have developed. It helps ground the story that much more in reality. Dark City would just, it's amazing noirish feel and style and, and the precision in which that movie is made would definitely visually probably be the most on for what we would like to try to accomplish with with origin that visual noir style with like the gritty realism of seven so up next is the trailer for my previous short film hidden valley we had the honor of being selected into about 16 film festivals winning awards in best screenplay and best cinematography the song featured in the trailer is by a band called living deadlights i also directed the music video for the song which debuted on rolling stones magazine online it was also played on mtv in europe and won best original song at shriekfest this past year the link for that music video is in the body of the project, but until then, here's a taste of it in the trailer for Hidden Valley. And so it begins. You see them and you run, you understand?
So now that you've seen an example of the quality that we try to obtain and achieve in all of our work, hopefully you'll find something within our last film and within this upcoming film that you really like and you can get excited about. We really love to make this short um, so we can get it out there, start creating a buzz and cre start creating interest. Ultimately, it's really about making that feature. Take a look at the incentives we have and, uh, and for the donations and do what you can. And hopefully there's stuff over there that'll interest you and that you'll like. And uh, every little bit's gonna help. Without you helping us out, we're not gonna be able to make this movie. So do whatever you can and we greatly appreciate it. We hope you like us and our project. Thank you very much and here's to making a movie. Thank you.